everyone, back for World 5 Gloomy Gulch, the ghostly area. So let's just press on here. This is a place I truly hate, more so than the swamp. Actually, I don't think you can get probably much more than the swamp. But this is what we got to deal with here. Ghostly ropes. I know that seems kind of stupid, but uh, it's a lot harder than it sounds. Once again, I think in this world, the music excels itself. It's really relaxing music despite its setting. Nice juxtaposition there. Let's, let's and analyze it. It's a nice juxtaposition. Oh, that was stupid. That was even stupider. Hmm. Sorry, guys, I'm not entirely sure what happened there. But for me being uh, an idiot. In my defense, I'll say it's because the difficulty is increasing. Yeah, that'll do. That's what you'll get from me on that one. The difficulty is going up. Yeah. Ugh. In case you can't see, the rope disappears just as its eyes start changing colour. They flicker ever so slightly. So uh, that's that's your. Yeah. That's your little warning sign. Oh yeah! There's two here for a reason? Yeah, there we go. Let's get it going. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. There we go. Gonna end up with a weird number of creme coins left over at the end of this. Oh, there we go. I'm not gonna lie, I do genuinely feel that this world is where we're going to see our first game over. I know I'm going to try and be a bit more optimistic than that, but uh, just can't shake that nagging feeling. I wonder if I trust that they go away. <laughs> Same ring to it as Kong, does it? Oh, I'm screwed now. I like many rope levels where I prefer Diddy. For obvious reasons, this is a Dixie level, and I'm so glad it ended there. Oh! <clears throat> that could have gone a lot worse. We'll count that as a momentary blip that life lost there. Now, the third. A final roller coaster level. Now, I remember a while ago I said that there were two ghosts. I had Cloak and Cackle. Well, this is Cackle's one and only appearance. And bearing in mind, I first played this when it came out. So I'd have been about nine. I'm not afraid to admit this guy creeped me out slightly. Bearing in mind, this is a kiddies SNES game. This guy's a little bit freaky looking. 
and I'm sure you can work out what the thing is. You've got to get to the checkpoints before the time runs out, otherwise he becomes solid and can hurt you. Much harder than it sounds. But we'll take a quick detour here. Try and collect the stars. I'll probably fail this one, but never mind, because it'll go ridiculously fast. Oh yeah, this is one where there's a lot more than the number is says, because it'll be impossible to pick up everything. There we go. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> and onwards we go. And there he is again. You see the challenge is set slightly differently given how fast you're going and how fast the time runs out. Whew. That's my least favorite one. I don't like that one. It's it's something about it that's wrong. So this one tricks you by that you don't want to hit the barrels, but it makes you go quickly. So you invariably end up hitting them like that. End! No! Ha 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 I suppose that's what they call close, isn't it? Ah, oh, yes, again! That was, um, intense. Whew. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, that was tense for me. Gusty Glade. Can you guess what's going to happen here? 